Yo, what up? How you guys doing out there today? This is your boy Roto Beast. I'm here to present you my MLB Core Plays for Tuesday, September 17th. If you're new to this channel, please make sure and click the subscribe button below. This week, you can watch all my MLB, NBA, and NFL videos. And if you haven't came and checked out our website here at DFSGSheet.com, you're absolutely missing out. We have all the tools to help you compete with the pros day in and day out, including a complete optimizer, tons of content, daily fando, and DraftKings cash lineups. Hey, we truly one stop shop for all your DFS needs. So make sure you can check out the site here at DFSCheatSheet.com. So talked about it earlier. Today was can we fit Verlander in with some course field pieces is kind of where I was really at. Um, I think I got a pretty good core for you guys to definitely get your cash game started. And we'll jump right into it real quick before we do. If you guys don't mind, please take that quick second, click the like button down below. Helps me out, and I really appreciate that from you guys. And, yeah, let's go. So I like Verlander. I mentioned it. He's a guy I want to get in my lineups today. I feel comfortable. Price tag's up there. I understand. But we got some good mid-tier guys that we can go with. So Verlander's a pitcher. pitcher it's an easy play. I don't have to spend too much time on that. Um, next, I'm going to go with uh, Mitch Garver, batting in his leadoff spot. Um, you know, I like Minnesota going against Ross Detweiler, and he's a guy that's been swinging a really good bat, giving us some power upside. And, um, yeah, man, I like him. 3100 is a great price tag uh, for him as well. So he's the first guy I'm going to go with. Then we're going to go to third base. I'm going to go with another mid-tier guy. I'm going to go with Vladimir Guerrero in this uh, cleanup spot today. Uh, should, should get some RBI opportunities as well. Definitely been a little bit up and down, but he does give us give us some power upside at 2,900. Um, I like him. I think that he's a really good mid-tier play. Um, next, we will move to the outfield, and a guy that's coming in pretty cheap for being in court field, Brandon Nemo, 3,300. Played him last night, didn't let us down, gave us a home run. Going to go right back to the well. Not going to say he's going to hit a home run today, but 3,300 for a guy in a really good spot going against Tim Melvin. In Coors Field, I think it's a pretty good play. Um, so, yeah, so my final play, I'm going to use my utility spot. I'm going to go with another uh, Met that I think is coming in a little too cheap. You got Wilson Ramos, 2,900, um, you know, batting in his fifth hole, going against uh, Tim Melvin. Yes, uh, you know, was out the lineup yesterday, back in there today. Um, I like him, man. You know, he's, he's, ha he's having a pretty good season overall. He batting in that five hole, he should get some RBI opportunities. Anytime you get a guy batting in the middle of the order um, at a sub-3,000 price tag in court field, I mean, it's an easy play. Um, so that's really where I'm at, man. You got 2700 to, to kind of play with. There's some guys that you could definitely throw in here. Um, you could probably pay up for another guy if you find another really good value play. But I definitely think this is a really solid start to your cash games. Um, if you want a more in-depth analysis on today's slate, make sure to check out the site, dfscheatsheet.com. And, hey, good luck tonight, guys. Peace out.